there was a guy in there just now. He's like, can I help you? And he's like, I ordered two extra large pizzas. I'm like, oh, mafia type shit. I ordered two extra large pizzas. You hungry, sir? All right, let's get your shit. This is Tyson's. You see, he's waiting still, bro. He's just vibing too. <laughs> He drinks so much water. Oh yeah, that water's nice and cold on the tinny tin tin. All right, Bubba, there's your waters. With love and fishies. Love, yeah. You know, good boy. Ugh, this smells so bad. Soak him in there with the foodies. All right. So now they're underneath. So he, just, he still knows that they're in there. Oh, I just got back from Tyson's walk. My fucking knee is killing me. Up. My mom always says, drying your sweaters doesn't shrink them. All black Nike one. Ooh, I'm tired. Come lay, come lay, sir. Come on, come. I know you're tired. Come lay with, come lay with me. Good boy. I, I, oh, I didn't say drop your bum on me, but okay. We're both tired. Got up at four. Got to work for four thirty a.m. with the hopes of being out of there by no later than seven seven thirty. Intentional plans got altered. I ended up leaving there at. 11 a.m. today, so 4.30 in the morning till 11 a.m. What, what's that, seven hours? So I did a seven hour shift on my day where I'm supposed to be off. So now instead of being well rested, I'm tired, I'm cranky, probably won't get nowhere near the amount of stuff I wanted to get done today. The water tank in my building burst, the hot water tank in my building burst, so now there's no water, no hot water, and barely any water pressure in general. Look at this guy just sprawled out right in front. I feel like that's what my life is now. I feel like I'm just rushing everywhere. I gotta stop here, and it's like rush, rush, rush. I gotta go there, rush, rush, rush. Like I said in the last video, life feels like now at this point it's just moving too fast, and some days I just have trouble keeping up. And because I always I always want to try, I feel like that's where I just exhaust myself. Just trying, just just trying to be in so many places at once, trying to help so many situations, be supportive for this or be there for that. I feel like I'm just mentally drained. From my own expectation of just trying to always be present and help where I can, I'm just exhausting the snot out of myself. I decided to try sriracha cream and garlic, see how this tastes. It also sounds like Mia is at like the peak point of the day where her like energy is good. Her energy just is like, bah, 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 bah. I can't wait till she talks. Honestly, cannot wait. I'm curious how she's like, how she'll sound, like what her voice will grow into. Sriracha cream, creamy garlic is actually fire. resemblance. This is eating it. Hard to be worn for the purpose of <sighs> I don't see the trucks of the workers that were working on the, the hot water tank. Please. Oh my god. So I'm off for two days. I'm really sick. Really, really, really sick. Yeah, you could probably hear it in my voice. The coolest thing is, I love when my voice sounds like this. If my voice could sound like this all year round, I would do it. If I had five wishes, I would wish to have the voice of somebody recovering from a flu. <laughs> Bubba, you give me the mean eyes. Hello, sir. Hello, sir. Give me the gum massage. The gum massage. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, I love his attention, man. Croissants. I guess that's the proper way to say it. I say croissant. It's almost time for the appointment. Sir. Sir.
from the doctor. It wasn't terrible news, but it wasn't the best news, so I had to get custom orthotics. Apparently, I've been wearing the wrong size shoes for like the last, basically all of my life. I'm actually a 13 and a half. I've been wearing a 13. So that created a, a, a potential bunion, which I never thought I would have. But what are you gonna do? So I got like a like a toe separator, a toe spacer that I need to put in between my toe on the right side of my foot where the bunion is developing to actually straighten the toe out because the toe isn't straight. The custom orthotics were like $500, but hopefully they work. And he recommended specific shoes called hookah. He wants me to get the shoes and the slides. I checked the price on Amazon. Bro, these shoes are like 350 bucks. Oh man, 350 bucks. That's insane. Hopefully this all goes and and, and it gets better and I, I, the pain goes away. And they also asked me for two specific motions no longer to do at work, which is squatting down, which is putting tremendous amount of pressure on my toes and my feet. And then that same exact motion, but when you pull a hand jack, and I don't know if any of you guys have watched this channel are familiar with that, but when you pull it, it's fine. You're going backwards, whatever. But when you have to push it forward and park the skid, you actually are doing the same motion as if you were squatting down to look at something really low. So they want me to immediately and permanently stop that motion uh, until my feet get better, if they even do. But that action is gonna, those particular actions are gonna prolong the process of getting better. So they have to stop immediately. This is what it looks like I'm gonna be spending the rest of my day doing. Just watching some UFC, living his best life. So this is my second set. It's not like a bad exercise, it's just 10 times a day. That's a lot. If you notice something, you see the little magnetic clip? I decided to put the lav mic inside my shirt. See if that makes a difference. So this is Joya Toes. I hate feet. Oh, I fucking hate feet. What's up, sir? What's up? What's up? I gotta go get my orthotics today. My shoes. Gotta see if I can find them. Mm hmm? Wish me luck. Wish me luck. Mm -hmm. A 13 and a half hookah shoe. I was on a couple of sites last night. Saw some promising shoes. But me and Jess agree. They're all so light. Okay. So it's like they can be orthotics. Totally get it. Why does the word hookah have to be so big? Like even with Nike brands, their shoe, the Nike swoosh isn't that big. And it just screams orthotics. Like these are orthotic, orthopedic shoes. Shit, man. And they're in like the brightest color patterns. Why? We can't just make some black shoes made by hookah that are all black? Doesn't he have this massive branding on it? Dang, man. I'm not embarrassed or anything. It's just, they're actually ugly. I got a lot of information. So I went to running room. The lady in there was super nice. So helpful. Like gave me so much information. I'm getting the custom orthotics. They'll come in two to three weeks. So the recommendation was the custom orthotics. Those shoes are different. Like some have more cushioning, but the more cushioning the shoe has, the orthotic is going to elevate your ankle, which in turn is going to be counterproductive. So you need to get a lower cushion so that when you get the orthotics, your ankle is still within the, the shoe line. A lot of information that I wasn't aware of. So I decided to go with Nikes. So I got these in a 14. It was the only thing I found. So I'm gonna go with those and then I'll put the insoles in those. So then the little bit of room, which is right here, which where my thumb is, when the insole goes in, I'm still gonna have some space. So then the insoles will be proper this is like i just said to jess though the only thing that sucks is now these are like my everything everyday shoes because right now currently they're the only shoes that are the proper size i'm supposed to be wearing and then these are the hookah slides so these are what was recommended by the physician that checked me out yesterday and i was like bro i like that color scheme i definitely like that color scheme now these where he rec he didn't recommend a size but they only had a 13 but when i tried the 13 on it fits just fine and these things are comfortable as shit all right we're here at costco with my big clown shoes on bro <laughs> i definitely bought way too much food i can't finish it i'm not even gonna try half my fries are left wish me luck i'm gonna drive with my my hookah slides man this is a look bro so i realized in editing the vlog i forgot to share with you guys how the slides are working out just kind of fix this light here so the slides are working out great. I don't get to wear them as much as I would like, but they are working out fantastic. 
Since I was told I have plantar fasciitis in both feet, and I got these slides literally, I think, a day later, this is like heaven on your foot. And that's not even an exaggeration. Coming from somebody who deals with foot pain every day, I would advise you to get these even if it wasn't recommended by a doctor. It is the best money you'll ever spend. I will say this, I got a little comfortable and I drove with the slides. I didn't like that, I didn't enjoy that too much, that wasn't my favorite thing. But overall, slides, great, helping the feet. 